Hi everyone, I'm cleaning out and organizing under my kitchen sink. It's a horrible mess, very unorganized. Everything always gets pushed to the back and lost and forgotten. So I went to Dollar Tree and to Walmart, bought a few supplies for organizing and cleaning, and I'm gonna get started and get a fresh start. But first I wanted to tell you about something that's been a game changer in my cleaning routine. It's the ultimate ultimate cleaning, uh, the ultimate home checklist. It's by Lori Heist. She's also here on YouTube, so I'll link her channel. And she also has a website called the um, Passionate Penny Pincher, and I'll put that in the description box below as well. Um, but it's really awesome. I'm a checklist person. So you give me a checklist of tasks to do and I'm gonna get it done. But what it is, is it's like a morning routine, an evening routine, and then Saturday, or I'm sorry, Sunday through Saturday, and it has different things to do each day, and then it has one big project to complete. This week, it's uh, cleaning under the kitchen cabinet, which just so happened to coincide with what I was deciding, what I had decided to film this week. So it worked out perfectly, but it, down at the bottom also there's um, Bible verses to read. So I do my Bible reading every morning. There's also exercise. Can't say I do the exercise every morning, but it's there to check off. And um, it's just really changed things. I had company over this past week. My house was clean. I wasn't embarrassed to have them come in. Everything was dusted, mopped, swept. It was perfect. I was so happy. I just love it. She also has this um, meal plan. So you plan out your meals again, Sunday through Saturday, and then you go through and decide what you would need or what your grocery list is, and it has it by category, so it makes it easier also when you're going through the grocery store just to check everything off. I love it. So um, it was, I think it's $15.95 for the printout. She had a spiral bound version, but that sold out before I even knew about it. So I printed mine out and put it in the notebook. She gives instructions on how to do that. She has a lot of information on the, on the plan itself, so if you're interested, be sure to go and check her out but in the meantime I hope you enjoy me cleaning out underneath my kitchen sink so these are the items that I purchased for organizing they're mostly from Dollar Tree and Walmart and this is my before disaster very unorganized I'm all up in a love haze, so. so I start by removing everything from the cabinet. Vacuum it out and I spray it with some antibacterial spray and wipe it really well. It really is a big space, but it's just awkward because the sides are at an angle and the garbage disposal and the pipes are in the way. So I'm just putting everything in the cabinet, kind of seeing how it fits and kind of like Tetris. You just kind of got to fit it together to see how it looks best. Now are organizing all my cleaning products by category. 
so that I kind of know what I want to keep and what can go in the back and what needs to go in the front of the items that I use more often. Those are all the products that are refills that I don't use very often or that are overflow. And they're going in the back. Tell me your story. Tell me and then I just arrange everything the way that I want it, the way that I think it looks good. How you move forward and still go against the tide. Yeah. Who did you make who made you strong? Yeah. Did you get help when I was rough? Yeah, yeah. Tell me your story. How did you make your dreams come true? You're so strong, I wanna be strong I wanna be just like you I wanna be just like you Cause you're so strong That's it. I even have extra space in an empty basket so I can go to the store and buy some more stuff. Just don't tell my husband. Tell me your story.